That's not gonna be good. So we're gonna do this twice. Um, one that's gonna pretty much be a, a single player, and one that's gonna be double uh, multiplayer. I was gonna say double player, but uh, yeah, we'll be having explodes here with us just to kind of have our person to be with. And uh, yeah, so you kind of joined in a little later, right? Yeah. I'm dead. Okay. Death by math. Here lies Masako. Killed Let's see. Get the numbers. I don't even know how to do more. Huh? What is it, Kyogo? There we go. That's better. Okay. So main plot of the of the game, which I actually was pretty uh pretty sold on it when it first came out. Was that these two supposedly lost their boyfriends? They got they got uh the boyfriends got kidnapped, and you look at that picture. It does not look like they're being kidnapped. <laughs> it just looks like they're going inside of a car. To be fair, the commercial kind of made them look beat up. But yeah. not, but not even here. Well, the, the, sure. you, you mean the um the 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 intro uh, the opening credits? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so doesn't look like we're having any frame skips, so I think that's the job well done, at least for the most part. If I have uh, certain uh, certain instances where, uh, like every thirty seconds, there'll probably be like one casual frame skip, I'm okay with that. I've always had that, but if I think for some reason with some of the newer games I've been getting, I'm um, having to deal with that. <laughs> okay, so I'm be playing as best girl here, um, Misako. Uh, she can't dab, but she she definitely has uh, decided to rip off any uh, any re any of the the series Street Fighter characters attacks, like uh, like Ryu. So as soon as I get access to the Shoryuken, I will definitely go ahead and do that. Uh, oh, that's the one thing I we kept forgetting to do. It was uh, recruiting people because <laughs> we kept dying so many times. Ah, there it is. Uh, are you still there, Explodes? I didn't lose you, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, good. Okay, I gotta remember I don't have access to all my powers when uh, Diego was here. Um, did you, do you even ha uh, have you ever even played this game before? No, I uh, did play the uh, Nesh game for a little bit. Uh, oh yeah, I believe we tried the, uh, playing that before, didn't we? Did we try playing that on the NSO? We planned on it, but we never really followed through. Because uh, I, I I believe it was not really fun. <laughs> yeah, not so much that it just I don't know. It it didn't look like it had enough spice to to warrant it. Because uh, it's pretty much this game, but like really really old graphics and very antiquated. Alright, cool. Uh, also, I was really in the mood to go play this game, just because I remember just how much fun it was playing with uh, with Diego. Um, there's always a sense of um, inner fun I have when it comes to uh, having a level up system, especially for like a brawler. <clears throat> uh, oops, got hit here. Okay, I'm looking at the stream a little bit. Yeah, we're we're not doing too bad. It's actually pretty darn good. But yeah, yeah. So I don't expect me to actually beat the game today. It is a pretty long game, but I'll, I'll probably pick up on this tomorrow and see if I could uh, either finish it or get through most of it. And hopefully we can make this 100% playthrough because I do want to see what happens when you get rid of all these Sabu statues. Also, I thought you already knew about that. Uh, wait, did I? Did, did we say there was any, any point to it? I think that was what was required for that alternate ending. I thought you just had to beat the game twice. Hmm. Hmm. Also, what's the block button? Oh yeah, it's the block button. Okay. Blocking is gonna be super relevant in this game. <laughs> I used to play this game without actually blocking before, and that was not fun because I didn't. I kept forgetting that blocking was an option, especially when you have games like uh, Streets of Rage, where I don't even think blocking was an option. But 
But yeah, here we go. So we got um we got our two um our two uh was it uh rival characters? Is that what you call it? <laughs> yeah. Because um I do believe you you end up fighting them. They end up being like a super boss, I think. Oh, they're they're the uh, they're the alternate ending boss, I believe. Yeah. Are you actually able to hear what's going on, or is it just like very faint? No, but I know this well enough. Okay, good. Okay, all right, all right, all right. And I believe they're one of the few NPCs that if you punch, they don't react to it. But this one, you're like, nah. <laughs> okay, so uh, as per usual, they locked us out here. Uh, and then we're introduced to these pom pom variants here. They like to sneak up from behind. And uh, be extra annoying. I'm going to try to ignore as many optional fighting sections as possible because they just waste time. Oh yeah, the block parry. But they do give money. They do give money, but uh, if you're going to be constantly uh, needing the money in order to, lose, to get back all your health, <laughs> that's not going to be fun. Okay. Get our little purity dude Buy some here. bras and stuff. I also find it funny, I didn't notice on the first time I played, but the guy in the background for the puberty video is actually one of the bosses. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you see this guy in the background, he's one of the bosses. <laughs> oh, Bobo. Yeah, Bobo, he's, he's the, the guy endorsing puberty. <laughs> so far the stream looks like, looking pretty good. Um, I'm, I'm very happy with that. It's going from from uh, green to yellow, which is an improvement going from green straight to red. Mm. Eh. All right. We got ourselves the green green monsters over here. Eh. Can't wait till I get my stomp attack. There we go. There it is. <laughs> Speaking of which, yeah. Gotta get used to having more of these sidekick people. All right, cool. Got all the money, and I don't have to fight with the money for Di with Diego. <laughs> no, trust me. That's that was technically that was really all that was happening. <laughs> with the Naruto running guys here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sadly though, no dabs. Uh, I probably said this already, but you know, no dabs on the floor. Uh, okay. Hey, are there dabs? No, there's no dabs. There's no dabs. I can confirm to you right now, there is no dabs. Though it was really funny. It was it was really funny how um, Diego got really into that. <laughs> well, you didn't have to point out that it was bath. Okay. Ooh, whoa, whoa! Where did you come from, my friend? I didn't summon you yet. All right, cool. I'm gonna take this also very methodically. I don't want to be dying every couple of seconds. I say that as I get punched in the face. Because this game can get pretty, pretty darn difficult. <laughs> if you're not prepared for it. Yeah. Yeah, because, uh, and plus it, it really punishes you for dying. <laughs> like, losing half your money really hurts. And, uh, yeah. There we go. Okay. I and there's no second player to uh, commit CPR yeah. with their feet. Oh, yeah, that too. Also, I think we can flat out ignore coming back to the school for um, uh, for that side quest with the chef dude. Because all he does is give you the, the Godai thing, which honestly, you tend to forget that anyway. Oh, come on, come on. The what now? The, that was... the the pepper spray lipstick. Uh you go. You remember I was calling him the KFC guy, but he wasn't because it, was, it was not actually his hair. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, all you get from doing that entire deal is getting an item that allows you to get more XP by fulfilling those um the, the creepy guy Godai his quests, but you have to have it equipped right before the uh, the XP and the money are given to you. Alright, cool. Oh! There we go. Hmm. 
I get my rolling dive. Yeah. Hey, what is this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank, you, thank you, game. I, I remember. Uh, where's my moves? I know I got something here. Headbutt, gut punch, uh, clinch knees, bounce throw, jump, jump hammer. Okay, I think I. Hopefully, I didn't miss something. Oh, no. No, no mercy. Okay. Eh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, right, cool. So I believe coming outside here, we're gonna get our um, our boss, our boss character, which is the uh, the security. Uh, well, not security. The um, the old uh, student, <laughs> the girl from continuation school. From what? Continuation school, or AK romper room. That's for what I remember. Ever heard of it? And it's pretty much uh, students that are in high school, but technically they are like, they should have graduated years ago. <laughs> so they call it continuation school. I do believe this is one of the only times that we actually get to see the character. I, I don't even think we have a, like a boss rush or anything like that. Also, good job on the detail of these spri the sprites. These guys always knock it out. <laughs> Look at that. Solid green. Yeah, the stream's doing pretty darn good. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm real liking this new setup here. Alright, good. So explodes. Do you think this is character material right here, Misuzu? <laughs> <laughs> uh, her voice is too deep. Well, you know what's funny though. She the she already has the has that written for her. Just give her the mega muscles. That's literally what <laughs> what we got to do for this character. <laughs> yeah. All right. Cool. Oh wow. Oh yeah. So they they really did uh they did try to balance the amount of damage. When you have two uh, people playing, because look, I'm already at uh, at this amount of health. Oof. Oh man, and I don't even have access to burgers. <laughs> eh. Eh. Okay, that's it. Ah. <laughs> uh. Yeah, because I'm already at this amount of health here. I'm not going to be too greedy here. Ah! ah. Yeah, let's get out of here. She's going to go Kyle Kim pretty soon. Oh, man, she sniped me in midair. Okay. What? Ooh. Flat out tried sniping me on that. Okay, cool. We're almost at that health bar. Then she's gonna go Kaioken. Okay, there she goes. Kaioken. Alright, cool. And jump over that. Okay, please hit this one over here. Are you gonna, are you gonna jump? Oh no, she's jumping. Oh man, she went right where I was going. Okay, hopefully I'm able to outlast this. She's doing the, the flurry blitz now. She's not she's not stopping. Okay, we got one more hit. One more hit. Oh. Ooh. And that's it. Yeah, first try. <laughs> first try. Let's see if the volume's actually actually showing up on stream here. I'd rather give you a hug. FYI. Stay down. I'll never spite you again. You got a real mouth on you. I see why Kuni likes you. Okay. All right. So I could I could afford to raise it up a little bit more. Yeah. Let's 
just get it. Let's raise up the audio a bit. Oh, here's the conversation I was mentioning. If you find Cunio and Ricky, you tell him the Suzu says hi. Yeah, the thing, somebody had to draw that. <laughs> Come on, Kyoko. Sorry for punching you so much. Oh no, don't lie. You you are definitely okay with punching that person brutally. Oh yeah, I got to make a kit and the XP and the monies. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and ex uh, accept these because these are our only things we could actually put on. And we gotta make haste and get ourselves a um, a Borgor. There we go. Got got more of the volume out. Uh, it felt really faint from before. Cool, level up. Oh, nice. No need for that. <sighs> so nice to get out of that crappy school. For sure. Wait, hold Let up. I think that's too loud. We're looking <laughs> no. <laughs> I have indifferences going on here. Uh, let's see. Come on, come on. Yeah. Come on, come on out. All right, yeah, because that is pretty dang loud for that. Uh, okay, I, I'm gonna just commit to that now. All right, back to OBS. All right, cool. For our boyfriends, remember? Oh yeah. We should ask if they wanna go too. Yeah. Uh, so, you're probably wondering, how do I get this copy? Well, I didn't go through the, um, whatchamacallit, um, what was it, uh, the original limited, uh, run avenue. I had to get a, re uh, re uh, a reproduced copy from the Korean edition, because if you try getting any one from the, uh, Amazon, it's going to be sending you over $100, and that's not going to be fun. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's pretty expensive. Obviously, limited run copies. Once they're done with, uh, it is really hard to um, get yourself a a cheap, legitimate copy of it. Oh, come on, now these guys are blocking. Push the blue. There you go. We got rid of Dwayne. That's pretty loud still, though. Okay. My indifference is back. <laughs> Oops, no. Get rid of this. Oh, there it is. We could actually have this oh, audio playing. Hey, the boy Jacksepticeye! Jacksepticeye! Oh, we need that his level. Mean something to us? <laughs> We've been neighbors since third grade. Oh yeah! Let's see. Hey, Masako! It's that creepy guy who lives down the street from you! Oh yeah. Didn't you get kicked out of your school for taking the girls' volleyball team? Who, me? <laughs> uh, anyway, nice weather, right? You, you catch the recent sports game? What do you want, Godai? Perfect, okay. Anyway, yeah, that's Jacksepticeye. Um, I knew immediately when I heard this guy's voice, I was like, wait a minute. That's Sean. <laughs> it's like, that is um, strange. I know Markiplier is in here as well. Uh, just based on the, like, he think, I think he's one of the uh, the shopkeep people. But yeah. Not so talkative today, huh? Explodes. Ah, I feel you, man. I got, I got it. I got some other business to attend to as well today. Um, uh, on, on Legends, I gotta go ahead and do another um, uh, showcase. Uh, excuse me, with um, with that 21 at a higher star rate, just cause you know everyone's expecting that now. Yeah, cool. You're cool with me. Oh, thanks, thank, thanks, game. I'm already doing that. <laughs> Ooh, yo, yo. Oh great! That means I got to do that entire section again with um, the angry, uh, the angry security guard. <laughs> just remember that. It's just you, so you only mess up like twice, probably. We. So we gotta get the dude his uh, his med burger. 
which I believe is all the way over here. And we just get locked away. Yay. Mmm. Mmm. There we go. There's the burger place. Hold up all my money. And it's the, the Merv Double. Buy it. Eat it. And then buy another one. And then give it to him. Ugh. Oh, great. Now we're locked in here because we did a actual questing. Uh, we, we progressed the plot here. <laughs> and I gotta love how this yo-yo is so, so good on range. No one can really touch me unless they do those cheap uh, long distance attacks. Yeah, right, cool. Come on, come on, come on. The McDonald's Happy Meal is over with. I got my speed again. You remember when, when uh, McDonald's had the Mighty Kids meal? <laughs> I remember that. That was um, that was literally during the point where I was outgrowing the, the whole concept of the, the Happy Meal. Because you didn't want to be eating a Happy Meal, but you still wanted the toys. And I, I believe the... Um, that was the Mighty Kids meal came at the, around the, the exact time where I was like, okay, cool, I can still, I can still legally get the uh, the toy that the kids meal has without feeling like a chump. <laughs> All right, cool. Ah, lame. Oh no, took one strike on my person. Oh, cool, nice slow up. I'm definitely gonna want to go ahead and get the the sure you can. It's gonna be very very good. Yeah, there it is. The Bruce backhand. Awesome. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, Nutcracker. Was it good? Okay. I guess I'll invest in Nutcracker for right now. I remember how that one was. Alright, right. cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Just gotta go back to Mr. Jacksepticeye and we'll be okay. Good, good. Alright, cool. And that's the Bruce backhand. Yeah, there it is. Okay. At least that still works. And then I believe the Nutcracker is with the down heavy. Yeah, that's down. Down heavy. There you are. So they friend. got Jack Septicai and Mark Blyer, but do they have a certain Swedish dude? Uh, Pewds? You yeah. PewDiePie? Um, I don't know. Maybe... Yeah, because when I think of when I think of the the YouTubers, I'm pretty sure a lot of the YouTubers will just do it in mass if they're asked to. But PewDiePie is very picky about things. <laughs> I don't think he's the type of individual that would be like, "Oh, you want my consent? Sure." No, I think he's more of like, mm, "I'll pass. I don't need the money." <laughs> well, he did South Park. Yeah, well, that South Park's uh, well, doesn't he like South Park though? <laughs> I have no idea. Like I, I'm, I'm obviously not so, not in the demographic that a South Park is aimed for. But even I know if you like something enough, you'll probably be okay with cameoing on it as yourself, probably. But for an indie game, I don't think he, uh, unless it was what YouTuber Life Two, where uh, they literally had PewDiePie as the main character in the game, <laughs> and he played it just for the lulls of it. Um, but I, I don't see him actually like being like, oh yeah, I'm one of the YouTubers that did the voices for these games. Like I'm pretty sure they they probably reached out to um, to uh, to Jack guy first to get the the role for this, and then later on they're like, oh yeah, let's see if we get others like Mark. Maybe there's other YouTubers I'm not aware of that are actually voiced in this game, but um, you know Mark has a very distinct voice that I I could uh, I, I I I typically can can catch. Especially when you're looking at, uh, was it the uh, the voice of Mark from uh, that one villain show? <laughs> oh, was it the uh, the very sexy version of the um, the main villain guy? Oh, was it Nefarious? Um, Nefarious, yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. It was it was only in the one short where he where Mark was actually using his very sensual voice. But um, you know, you, unless unless you're telling me that that, that uh, Mark is is voicing, of all things, the bear character, I'm obviously gonna tell. 
that uh, it's Mark because uh, yeah, Mark actually voiced the bear character, and the bear only makes these grunting slash uh, baby like noises. <laughs> How can you actually tell me that's Mark just by listening to that? You can't. <laughs> I don't know, it actually does kind of sound like him, now that I think of it. Yeah, it is Mark, but uh, like the more I'm pronounced like Mark voice is the the uh, the sexy version of um, of uh, Nefarious that shows up right before he, he blows up the broadcast. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, the only, thing just... mo- the only thing more evil than, than having you uh, uh, witness me is by... Uh, Most... What was it? Uh... Not having the evil thing I can think of is no more mirror. It was one of those very very short ones, like they uh, they really did not. Um, I would I would have really loved to see them expand more on that show. That show had potential. It, it was pretty much <laughs> m- was it not Mega Mind? There there was a show with some some really like jerk heroes. Oh, what was it? Oh man, there there was a show that I remember before that. Um, I guess you, if you want to consider uh, minions, <laughs> but I don't remember any jerk heroes in that one. Not st- stay down, my they friend. They did get very full season. Then it wasn't like only what two episodes that ever aired. No, they had a full season, but only the pilot got an English translation. Ah, uh, that's the one that I saw. How unfortunate. Yeah, that was such a good show, uh, from what I saw. It, it's uh, it's a shame that it had to end that way. Because <laughs> uh, the characters were pretty cool. Um, you know, I know the box, the the the, the I was gonna say the lunchbox head guy, but the uh, the cardboard the cardboard box dude. Paper bag. No, the paper bag. Yeah, the paper bag guy. Uh, is not as as uh, cute uh, looking as he uh, as he sounds, <laughs> but it's um, you know my favorite my favorite one just in in general to listen to is just nefarious. He <laughs> that that dude is pretty much if you dropped Robotnik from the ser- the quote unquote serious Sonic cartoon into the Scratch and Grounder cartoon and see what happens because. <laughs> Regardless of what you want to think, um, Robotnik from uh, the Scratching Grounder cartoon was still still pretty stupid. <laughs> Smart enough to not be immune to his demification, Ray. <laughs> You're not supposed to pull that lever. <laughs> You're not supposed to pull that lever. Cool, got on my first try. <laughs> All right, gonna get the speed run for this one now. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Take that, other student. Goes to my school. I'm gonna beat you with a yo-yo. <laughs> take that. And take this. <laughs> oh no, no mercy for you, my friend. Okay, mercy for you. <laughs> Just cause. It, it makes things go back faster. Oh, volleyball time. Eh. Eh. <laughs> eh. So eh. That was everyone. Ah, oh, great. No. Somehow it missed everyone again. Yeah. It's one of those things. Those painful things. Ah, no. Yeah, right, cool. Volleyball time. Ah, no. Finally hit someone. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I could do, um... I could do, uh... What was it? Uh, po- pocket sand as well. <laughs> yeah, cool. Got a refresh on that one. Oh, this is the thing that Diego and I missed. It didn't look like a door, but you can go through here. Okay, well, that missed. Let's try again. <laughs> What? They're not active? Am I not in the same plane of existence? Oh yeah, they weren't active. <laughs> Let's do that again. You had to watch them do their workout routine. You could tell that guy was spotting it. It's funny. Oh 
man, I just got jumped over there. Yeah, I'm probably gonna want to get some food in my system. Yeah, because I'm definitely gonna be wanting the whole. Oh, oh, cool! I get the luchador, dude. <laughs> eh, eh, eh. All right, I'll go stop by the store. And uh, no, it's not what I wanted. And go fill up on food because I do not want to lose all my money here. There we go. Uh, oh man, uh, was it Fizzy Fuzz was the thing that I, I was trying to get from before? The galaxy's so dead inside. Oh, 10. Yeah, that he's, he's pretty much every, um, every, uh, person that, uh, that serves food to people in the U.S. <laughs> Not happy with their existence. See you later. Uh, cool. Especially at the gas stations. <laughs> oh, mother cool. to Sunday. Just to that. Okay, we'll go ahead and stock up on those. Yeah, Sundays look like that's where it's at. Gonna buy it and save it. Because that's something that Diego and I weren't doing. We weren't thinking ahead. <laughs> uh, okay, I got 95 bucks. Gonna need to go ahead and... Um... Because we, we kept making the bad decisions. <laughs> All right, cool. We have access to the uh, the mall now. I know what to do now. <laughs> Just gotta go inside and actually uh, interact with the dude at the very end. Uh, does this character have any actual um difference to the the plot <laughs> whatsoever? I don't remember. I think they were just trying to showcase all the. Characters in the series, and then also throw in some Double Dragon stuff. Which is he? Is he part of the Double Dragon people? I don't know. I don't really know all the lore for either series, especially since this one mostly in Japan. Back uppercut, jump kick, jump hammer. I keep getting all these moves, but I keep forgetting what they are. Ground stomp, human weapon. Oh yeah, I can do human weapon now. Seriously, though, it's kind of weird that the only ones who don't know that these two, the two heroines of the story are the girlfriends of the dudes, the only ones that don't know that are the dudes. Everyone else is pretty much familiar with this. Or maybe those weren't their actual boyfriends to begin with. They're just doppelgangers. <laughs> maybe we'll find yeah, that. They, cool. <laughs> they watch the sequel be like, oh, they were chasing the wrong boyfriends. Those were just doppelgangers. Alright, toss that. I, I mean, this universe has a whole bunch of people just, um,. Uh, fighting these two arguably most violent girls in the city for no reason. <laughs> they have no reason to be doing this. That's, that's your uh, go-to? Not the fact that one of the earlier bosses has literal dark magic powers? Yeah. And we still beat him up. And, and then it's like the Oh, wasn't it the designer lady, the designer lady that had this dark magic powers of some sort? No, I think she's just very good at threads. <laughs> mm. All right, Coolio, I made it past. And that maybe necromancy, but I don't know about that one. Uh, she had zombies. Oh wait, I forgot this one has an item on them. Take them, luchador. Yeah, because there's, there's obviously zombie people here. And I just kind of overlooked. <laughs> zombie children. Which, in itself, is a pretty, uh, pretty sad implications. Yeah, they're just fashion zombies. 
Don't want to stay too close to the Chad characters. They love to do. They love to throw the pocket sands, which is a very very low blow. I commend him for that. <laughs> they're, they're the guys that bring a gun to a uh, to a fist fight. That is exactly what I would do. Oh, see, threw pocket sand on me. <laughs> I'm Careful, the Lucha Ball can only take one more hit. Oh yeah, it's this guy here. This guy really wants you to really wants you to buy uh, the padlock bra. He wants to enforce virginity. <laughs> I forgot what this does. Either that or it's uh, some uh, what's it called <laughs> double the velocity. That one with thrown weapons. <laughs> could be something like that. Uh... Desert car apocalypse thing. What's it called? Yuri Road. Let's see. What's the gym shorts do again? One ST with each enemy defeated. Yeah, might as well just do that. There you go. Ooh yeah. Yeah, because all the Ooh, chat. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. You would you would think a Kool Aid Man would hang around here. No, that was Randy Savage. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my bad. <laughs> kool Aid Man is more like, oh yeah. Cosmic Mega Babes. Yeah, but they only had the standard edition cover. I could barely bring myself to read it three times. I can understand the the feeling of getting the not so amazing edition of a of a of a thing that you like. It just doesn't feel the same. Be careful. This one's made of plastic instead of vinyl. <laughs> okay, cool, cool. No, at least he admits his life is boring. Yeah, because he's not the main character. That was one of the things that I, I really, liked, really liked about Sonic Boom. <laughs> was They were all setting up this thing for the race that they were going to have. And, and uh, <laughs> the, the, the mayor is like... Guys, you realize that it's not all about you. You guys got to fill out the proper paperwork and stuff. <laughs> and uh, arguably... And everyone else is allowed to participate. Yeah. I, I, I love how Barker was the first one to go down. <laughs> he didn't even make it past the, the, um, the, uh, the opening gate. Because Dave the intern just completely s sniped him. Which one is Barker again? Uh, Barker is the uh, the weasel guy. He, he's the one that uh, sold Knuckles' his house. Dude. The circus dude. Yeah, the circus dude. Oh, great. Boba tea. None of that. Okay, cool, cool. Cool beans. Alright, so... Oh, we gotta go this way. My bad. Let's go eat some food first, because that's a thing that you can easily sneak up on you. Yeah, yeah, stat menu. Uh, Sunday! There we go. Sunday! 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 Oh man, you remember Monster Truck <laughs> events? Have you ever been to one of those? I was all uh, going... Actually... Blue Hill Fair had a little bit of it. Yeah, I remember going to, I think, three Monster Truck shows period in my life and that's pretty much it one of them i actually fell my butt it was during the uh, a rainy day and uh the mud <laughs> i remember slipping and falling on my butt and uh getting all that uh mud on there and i'm like oh no <laughs> now my mom's gonna be angry at me all day because those are freshly ironed <laughs> well then she shouldn't have had you take them to the What's the truck route? Well, that was that was just me not paying attention to what I was doing. <laughs> also, we didn't know it was gonna rain. Which, actually, if a monster truck uh, event has rain, you know that it's gonna be a great day, because you know mud's gonna be splattering everywhere. Mmm, mmm. Get down. All right. Got a couple more. Oh, we got cheerleaders. Man, I I'm I'm looking at this. And I'm, I'm instantly just thinking that the game's way easier because I think they threw in more more enemies on screen because of the two player function that we were going through before. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, because Diego, Diego and I, we, we, we had so many enemies on screen. It was, it was, it was crazy. Maybe you set this difficulty setting wrong. No, it, it was on normal. I just think that they were compensating for the amount of players on screen by having uh, more, more people there to, to justify that. All right, cool. Come on, give me my, give me my money. All right, so I kind of lost track. Uh, this is the part where he says, "Oh, this is not the mall," so we go and um, go to the good, good part of town or something, something like that. I'm pretty. I, with, with, with took Diego and I what a couple hours. I'm I'm already blasting through now. Well, that's because you actually know what to do now. <laughs> yep. Damn straight. <laughs> oh, cool. I got the haymaker thing. Eh. Eh. Velocity <laughs> throw. Oh, that's actually pretty useful. The bomber are actually pretty, pretty snazzy. Again, I think if your partner is knocked down in multiplayer, you can use them as a weapon too. <laughs> it's actually pretty. You can funny. do that in. You can do that in River City Ransom. Um, uh, how many games of River City Ransom were there, or was it just the one? I don't know. A lot of them were just sports spinoffs. I feel like a lot of which. I feel like that was probably just a popular game. Like the first game was just popular, and then the other games were probably just not as good. And that's probably why you don't hear about it till now, because the River City Girls IP kind of revived it a bit. But now only people know <laughs> about the River, C River City Girls, not Ransom. <laughs> that's arguable since there was a lot of games through the NES, NES, and some Sega consoles. I think it was popular, it just got oversaturated, probably. Mm. Yeah, so my dad's just showing up asking if the, the stream looks good. It, I'm, I'm getting no no real substantial dip, so it looks like we're, we're back in business. But yeah, go, yeah, now we got Pocket Sand back in our team. Um, but yeah, the... Um, what were we talking about? Oh yeah, River, River City. Yeah, I, 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 we just don't hear anything about that. <laughs> yeah, give me that bat. Give me that bat. Let me break this. All right, cool. Whew. Where this entire place floods with people. All right, so we're going to the good, good part of town, right? That, that's the the next objective. Oh yeah, good. Oh no, it's the uh this guy here. Magic dude. Magic D? Uh But that's his name. <laughs> Forgot what his name was. Oh yeah, right here. Right away. Next boss. <laughs> Oops, pressed the wrong. Shouldn't have pushed that button. There we go. Right over here. I'll let this cutscene play out. This guy here. The magic wielder dude. The necromancer guy. Or, not necromancer guy. The warlock dude. With a really, uh, really bad backstory. <laughs> Intentionally written that way. Tragic yet... Stale. <laughs> now he's the epitome of, like, so cool, but he's just so dumb. <laughs> I mean, like, it's a legitimate reason, but do you have to take magic into this? <laughs> I turned to the dark arts because my best friend I only knew for a little while uh, decided to ask or talk to a girl I just saw but didn't even talk to. <laughs> and he knew I did. I'm going to be really sad if, if, if in the next game they really just point out that the... Um, that the guys, the, the boyfriends are just uh, full of crap. <laughs> like, they're just not good people. And then you just question yourself, why am I rooting for these people? Is this gonna take long? I was sure I'd never make another friend. 
Like, like you see this backstory here, and you're like, oh no, he was by himself. He was, he, he had nobody except he found this guy. They played games, and he just violated the bro code, and now I'm angry. <laughs> They've always been betrayed us, good people in the past, so that would be a pretty big wreck. Honestly, I think that the girl, and I don't don't look too deep into this, but I think the girl actually looks prettier when she was younger, as opposed to what she looks now, where she just looks like she's trying to still be a young girl. Unless that's the joke, but. You see how she's drawn here as opposed to how she looks like when she's older? She just completely looks worse now. I did kind of rock on the girl's, the original girlfriend, attitude. First Later in middle kids. school, I love that. It's like yeah. <laughs> it's like not important things. I lost the love of my life and my best friend in the same day. But thanks to the dark arts, I will never again be the modernization. It's gonna be so jarring playing Zero and then just see that um you you play this really old style like 16 bit style and then it goes to the anime cutscenes. I'm more interested in seeing what the anime cutscenes are doing and I really want to know why they look styled in the in the the Gundam style. I like it, but I just really want to know what they're going to do with it if it's voiced or just cutscenes for the sake of cutscenes. All right, cool. It's time, uh, time to go ahead and uh, and spam the the wall crawler kick. There you go. Get out of here. Oh. Whoa! I actually interrupted that. Mm, mm, mm. And there we go. Yeah, there we go. Booyah. Okay. Yeah, Looks like he's just gonna throw it right in front of you, so uh, probably just give it a good nut punch. He's just gonna teleport right in front of you. You might as well just punch the second he starts disappearing. Yeah. Hey, you do more damage if if he goes off the other cliff. But actually, I'm gonna eat some Sunday right in front of me. Thank you. Oh, no. Eh, eh, eh. Booyah. Yeah, I'm doing way more damage than I used to. <laughs> with, with Diego around. Hmm. There you go. You should be falling. Oh, no, you didn't. There you go. Okay, that's enough damage. Just gotta make sure we're not in the same plane of existence. Because you could just easily get out of that. Hmm. Okay, already halfway through his health. Prince and repeat. <laughs> hmm, there we go. Now we have a point behind you. Don't mean anything if we're not on the same plane of existence. <laughs> there we go. Oh, great. Now, now this is where things get a little difficult. Ah, it's hard to do that in a in a huff. Okay, okay, come on, come on. Oh, now he's walking away. Oh wow, I, I avoided the first one. Okay, good. That did a bunch of damage then. Mm. <coughs> come on, come on. There we go. Yeah! <laughs> that was enough. I brute forced that one. And good thing I had food. 
Fun. <laughs> that should be enough to get leveled up too as well. I'm so confused the whole deal with Kyoko. Like is she just is she just is she just crazy? <laughs> no, I think she's just Valley girl. No, because she's like she one moment she's like, Oh that's creepy and then the next moment she's like, Yeah, let's go beat him up. That's <laughs> like, just her being a best friend. Hmm. And a lover long longing girlfriend. Blah body blah reasons, reasons, reasons. I love that answer. <laughs> I love that answer. All right, cool. We got the love letter. We got 2,000 XP, and we got 350 money. All right, so that was enough to level up. We're gonna get, go get the Shoyuken. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh, actually, buzz off. <laughs> okay. Um, where's the dojo at? Where's the doge at? I think it's in this next screen over here. Yeah, so far, internet. I wonder if the dojo is Bammy or Jet. Yeah, we got the backflip kick, which is straight out of Sonic Battle right there. Drop kick, I like that one too. Uh, German suplex is not even that good. It's just it it, it you, you can't even control when you can do that. So I'm not doing it this time. So we're gonna get the spiral uppercuts, cause that is a re that's really good re utility. Uh, stone hand, stun gun. Uh, I think stun gun's another grab move, so we're gonna just ignore that for now. But uh, the drop kick, I actually want to see if I can do that one. Oh man, he just came in out of nowhere. Uh, let's see, what is it? How do we do the drop kick? Uh, oh, so it's just a different. Uh, oh, okay, it's a special running move. Oop, come on, come on, let me let me just kick you. No. Oh, okay, so it's at the same time. Oh, it's um, what's the what's the name of that character? Uh, oh, it's the me brawler uh, side special. <laughs> or Bowser's side smash. That too, but uh, well, yeah, it's actually that because you can't charge it. <laughs> but that's what I think of when I when I see that. Okay, uh, let's get some food in our system, and it will be good to go. Let's get some ice cream because that's apparently the best value right now. Get some of that. No. And there we go, and then we're good. Okay, so we need to get to the good part of town, I think, which is up here. I'm I'm assuming, or was this the? Uh... Oh yeah, this is the part now. It's open to us. Goody goody grum drops. Booyah. Oh, okay, good. So you want to you want to combine that with other things, just like the sure you can. Hmm. Hmm. And then we'll toss this with our extra velocity. <laughs> Thank you. Sure you can. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, that looks like it hurts a lot. Ah, no. Okay, okay, come on, come on. Oh, cool. Do this. Free one. Oh, nope, that's not it. <laughs> Screwed it up. There we go. That seems that looks incredibly painful. I, I like that. All right, cool. Just getting back up. Uh, okay, we'll we'll hire him for for now. And booyah. And sure you can. Good as some knockdown to it. Thank you, man. I'm just making a. Man, this game's way more fun than I know I'm doing. <laughs> like I said that during the whole deal with Diego, but I did not play this game correctly before. I know there's there's quite a bit more game left in here. Get out of here. 
Oh, that would have been cool to combo that up. Sure you can. I'm pretty sure the, the cry from that dude is also probably Jacksepticeye. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Cool beans. Oh, this is the, the good part of town now. This is what they call good? I mean, look at it. It's it's actually um, well kept. <laughs> it looks worse condition than the other parts of town. <laughs> no, the other parts is like the normies. Mm, mm, mm. It's, it's garbage and stains in the street. Get out of here. Thank you. Sure you can. Oh. This isn't considered a good part of town. I'd hate to see what's considered the bad part. Oh, you've never you never seen it? <laughs> there is a bad part of town in this game. And ironically the robot works uh works in that area too. A robot? Yeah, there's a robot that works there. <laughs> Ah, cool. You gotta love it when that happens. Cool, let's throw you out over there. Go join your friends. <laughs> Booyah. Give me all that money. Oh, cool, we got the strippers here now. Yeah, woo! Getting us something. This guy, because he's by himself. Oh, great. I like that's not stripper wear, definitely. Okay, gotta go ahead and eat our food. There's too much pant legs to be a stripper. <laughs> How do you know this? <laughs> How do you not? I'm sorry, but I don't associate with knowing such things. Excuses. Smack, smack, smack. I know about thoughts, but I don't know anything about that. <laughs> Anyways, as before, that's one of the double dragon enemies. Okay. Hey, there's our, there's Mr. Jack. Oh, hey, it's you two again. I got another mission for you. And I do believe you need to do these quests in order to continue, so it's not like they're optional. Uh, may depend on which quest, quest it is. I doubt that you'd have to do all of his quests. It doesn't feel like uh, like they're optional. I could be wrong, though. And we got uh, another character here. Is she from the original roster of River City? I don't know. I'd have to look up every single detail, and I'm too lazy. No, no that's fair. <laughs> that's fair enough. I think they're putting her in the sequel, though. Was, it, was that her? With the... Mm, besides the, uh, the, two, the, the continuation schoolgirl, this is like the, the most jacked girl we've seen so far. Well, there is one other Jack girl in this game. Uh, pretty much the double dragon girl that kept putting the two brothers against each other, decided to actually defend herself <laughs> without swallowing it. Um, I guess I'll look forward to that. No, yeah, you've seen it before. Um, it's been a while since I played there? this game. And also, I remind you, I did not play this game the way it was meant to be back then. I got, I got, I think I got all the way to the final area and just kind of stopped playing the game because I just got frustrated with the difficulty. And again, I, I forgot blocking was a thing. Oops. For that. Ooh. And I don't remember the game being as easy as I'm, what I'm doing right now. So that's a plus. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, got me on that one. Get out of here. Get 
Alright, nope. Oh, great. Ah, I got me the combo there. I need more food. That's definitely a, a need right now. I just realized she just casually carries a hockey stick wherever she goes. Like she's some kind of Casey Jones. Um, what? <laughs> She's not even wearing rollerblades or roller or ice skates. She's just holding a hockey stick. And you haven't? You don't? You don't? <laughs> no, I don't fight purple dragons. <laughs> it's like you never have. <laughs> no. What have you been doing with your life? Uh, not communicating with four mutant ninja turtles. Also, I, I like to I like to think that the the purple haired uh, schoolgirl is just a very big Ace Attorney fan. <laughs> Why? Uh, she looks like Maya. Ooh. Yeah, very purple. Uh, the purple hair and everything. My hair doesn't have purple hair. Sorry, is it? No, it's it's Maya, isn't it? Yeah, it's Maya, not Mia. Oh, we got a Mario brother over here. Purple hair. Yeah, she has purple hair. No, she has a purple outfit. Oh, great! It's this area. Her hair is black. I thought it was purple. I must be thinking about the. Uh... No, her outfit. Black. Oh, okay. Her right. outfit is black. I mean purple. Got me confused. Right, this spot here. I remember we got a premature death here with Diego. Yeah, the sidekick seems to be very, very effective here. Nah. Ah. So I don't want to die. I don't want to die here. There we go. This seems to be a lot. Oh yeah, there we go. Mm-hmm. Get him up. <laughs> yeah, that does a lot of reach, especially when you aim it right. There we go, look at that. It's a good keep away technique. And occasional combo maker. Yeah, look at that. And I gotta level up for that, so now I'm not afraid. Yeah, that's a, that's a very safe combo, just the, the one-two. Oh yeah. And they're gonna just worry about the, the pocket sand, dude. I keep getting special meter really fast, so it's not like I'm being punished for using it. No. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you, you really have to mix into a combo in order to get the use out of it. There we go. Also, the nice little Easter egg. There's a there's a little River City guy up here. Yep, that's uh Gunya. Yeah, okay, cool. Uh, <laughs> DVD. Oh yeah, this is the full heels. <laughs> oh great. So we if we buy Bounty Last, it's a full uh, full heel. I think all these are just full heals, so uh, I don't have the money to be spending on just the full heal like that, so we'll keep on moving, but wait, there should be better stuff on this side, right? Uh, there's the arcade, no, oh, uh, it's, yeah, it's all expensive stuff, as you would get in the best part of town. <laughs> uh, ooh, boomerang. There we go. Ooh, okay. That's not. So oh, forgot the vending machines do that. Uh, okay, we got the guy that skipped leg day here. Um, Five hundred bucks for this thing. Yeah, this is super expensive. There's there's no way I'm gonna be able to to afford any of this junk here. Uh, nope. Okay, keep on moving. I guess. Oh yeah, this is where the mayor statue's at. Whoa. <laughs> 
my Dragon Ball apps going off. Oh, the, the Kirby Star Rod. Take that. <laughs> Just randomly a magic wand. No. Oh, great. It's gonna go knock it off then. There we go. Yeah, I got a loot can door, do and I'm not afraid to use it. <laughs> Should've used him to break the statue. Oh, great. Oh, cool, I got the statue destroyed now. Eh, man, I'm, okay, I'm caught in the middle of all this. Hold up, guys, hold up. Wait your turn. I gotta do my awesome combo. There we go. <laughs> That's what we were talking about. Mmm. Mmm. There we go. Boy. Yeah. Okay. You lead that into a combo. Booyah. Booyah. <laughs> Boom. Man, that's such good reach. Take that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Gotcha. <laughs> Booyah. Throw it. Oh, miss. Booyah. You can probably just hit them once or twice while they're bouncing on the way back. No, no I don't want to get get off my rhythm. That's the sound of a dead man talking. <laughs> no, it's the sound of a guy who likes to cause damage. Well, the cops, oh, the, the, cops damage. Showing, the cops are here now. Guys, what are you doing? <laughs> The bad guys are over here. Oh wait, I did just destroy the mayor statue. To be fair, some of them helped. Oh no, no! Thank you. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. But I'm gonna show you can you now. Not crack, not crack, and oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, gotta be very careful about this now. <laughs> okay, I gotta be very careful about this. Okay, one of them's down. Now I just gotta get the other dude. Oh, great! That's gonna be fun. Very careful, because I could easily just die here for no reason. Right, they're both layered on top of each other. No, 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 no. Okay, separate them, dude, please. Okay. Okay, smack them on the ground. Okay, come on, go down. Okay, drop this on there. Smack, smack, okay, good. Oh boy, okay. We're in a bad situation right now. No! Oh, oh man, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. Damn. Bummer. Yeah, I mean, it, it, I tried to, to space them out, but there's always that fear that they're gonna come in and uh, and uh, wait, did, I, did I lose the mission for that? Did I have to do that all over again? Oh, I have to. Okay, never mind. Damn, it's the first death of the game already. All because of the two cops there. I, I was almost. Uh, they were probably the last ones I needed to take out too. Yeah, there we go. Now we're locked in. I just gotta keep doing the the whole kick thing. Kick, 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 kick. Okay. Thank you. Picking up this item is being a problem for me, so I'm just gonna toss it. There you go. Come on, come on, come on. Drop kick. If I do the drop kick into the shore, you can. Uh, there we go. Oh, 
Oh no, he actually chased me on that one. So you can. <laughs> oh, there it is. I was able to do it. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Get the Kirby Star Rod. Booyah! Throw that. There you go. <laughs> it's a cool way to chase him. Oh well, yeah, there we go. Toss it. There we go. Okay, we're back to where we were. And we got more health than we started with. Okay, come up. Oh great, it's not it's not there anymore. There I go. Ah, I still got hit from that. Oh <laughs> yeah. Whoa! What happened to that dude? Don't tell me he's broken. Take this. Take your comrade. <laughs> oh yeah. That should be it, right? That's it, right? Oh no, there Oh man, there was more? Great. Don't tell me to get pummeled here. Get over there. <laughs> Shoy. Ah, uh, can't even do the show you can, right? Hmm. Ah, uh, great. Don't want to get pummeled again. Throw him out there. I don't think they can block the specials, so I'm gonna just. Yeah, I don't think they can block the specials. They can block your regular melee assaults, but not the specials. Yeah. And Kabuya. And there. Come on, go. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Ah! Okay, now we just gotta deal with one. And. There we go. That forgive me so much grief. Cool. And we practically got our money back. And a level up. <laughs> Alright, cool. Now we can go into here. Which I believe was the next plot point where uh, we had to go find the uh, the necromancy girl. Is this, this is the necromancy girl? Yo, Explode, you still there? Yeah. Okay, this is the necromancy girl's hideout, right? Honestly, we might have to end it before we get to that, because I am close to lower than myself. Oh, okay. All right. Well, we'll finish things up with here. I think this was a pretty successful uh, stream. I got the stream to actually uh, work out the kinks here. So, um, yeah, I'm satisfied. I'm, I'm actually so after this room, we'll, we'll just call it a part here, and then, uh, yeah, we'll we'll continue this tomorrow. Actually, want to see if it's not just a, a bit of good luck that we um, have a better streaming uh, experience. All right, come on. No, oh, cop, help me. <laughs> sure, you can. Uh, there we go. I mean, if they decided to do a crossover, I don't know what their plans are for the sequel, but it would be really cool if they had, um, was it Monica be a playable character? Got the whole school setting, uh, schoolgirl setting there. And I do believe this this game is very self-aware that's a video game. Hmm. Ah, got me on that one. Eh. Get out of here. Oh, cool. Got some ramen for that. Okay. Drop kick! Alright, alright. Oh, okay. We got these people we gotta deal with. Play this some ricochet. Oh, no, no, no. Don't want that. Cop, help me! Oh, she was on the floor here. I didn't even see that. I thought she just faded out of existence. 
sure you can? Oh yeah, I think that's enough. She probably has a knockback. Oh cool, we could recruit her. All right, cool. All right, well, we'll end things there. We'll, we'll, we'll pick up for her tomorrow, and then I'm gonna a little bit of pause here, and then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, hop right into Dragon Ball Legends, because uh, we got that 21 video to do. So, until next time, we'll see you, and thank you guys for sticking with all the notifications, because uh, we really have to get that thing sorted with with the whole internet. <laughs> but it looks like we're doing good now. So until next time, see you guys. Bye bye.